another one of my quick ones to share something I've been saying loads lately that you may find helpful. So this is about how to create an autistic friendly environment. So I always find myself coming back to my three C's uh, and the three C's are calm, consistent and communication. So if we're looking at a classroom or a working environment, any kind of environment for a autistic person, child or adult, in fact, firstly, is it calm? Is this an environment where there's not too much noise, either literal or metaphorical, um, not too much going on in terms of busy, loud, unpredictable noises, um, a little quiet hum is OK. Um, um, are the people there calm? Are the walls and the environment quite calming, soothing kind of environment? So a calm environment. Um, the next is uh, consistent. So autistic people, everybody benefits from consistent, predictable environments. So routines, clear sharing of rules, knowing what our boundaries and our expectations are, knowing what's expected of us and things happening in a similar kind of way. And then thirdly, communication. We often get this wrong. We need to communicate in simple, concrete ways, in ways that our autistic children or adults can hear. So this is about learning with the individual about what modes of communication work best for them and then communicating in that way consistently. So for some of our learners, this will be about using things that are visual. For others, it might be breaking things down into bullet points in written form. Others will work well uh, with verbal communication, but having consistency of communication and making sure our communication is clear and that it is provided in ways that the autistic learner or person can hear and understand. So calm, calm environment, Consistency, predictability and communication. These are the three C's I look to and think about first when trying to create a more autistic friendly environment. And remember, when we create an environment that is autistic friendly, so it's suitable for people like me and other autistic people, then we create an environment that is more user friendly to absolutely everyone. You will do no harm ever by doing these things. However, you will do great good, not just for your autistic uh, friends, children, people, but for everybody. Everybody benefits from these things. So think about it. OK, that's all I have to say for now. It's now Friday evening, almost time to just stop, take a moment and transition to the weekend. Take care, everyone. Bye.